Well, for out-of-town visitors, it's one of Detroit's most photographed symbols. Uh, but now this famous downtown sculpture, the symbol of the city itself, is in need of some new support and care. Seven Action News reporter Dave Llewellyn is downtown to explain this big makeover. It's 24 feet long and weighs 5,000 pounds. Over time, the cables supporting the Joe Louis fist weaken from its weight, so the iconic bronze sculpture has some helping hands today. It's actually in very good condition. Uh, the thing that we're correcting today with the recabling is uh, the slight uh, tilt that it's taken over time, probably due to the wind blowing and maybe traffic vibration. So we, we will um, reorient it in its proper position. John Steele with the Detroit Institute of Arts is overseeing the project. In addition to new cables, the sculpture will undergo a cleanup and waxing. We apply wax to many of our outdoor bronzes as a protection against weathering and graffiti and things like that. Officially known as the monument to Joe Lewis, the fist was presented as a gift to the DIA back in 1985 in recognition of its 100th anniversary. It probably started out as a somewhat controversial piece, but now I think people really love it and identify it with the city of Detroit. And I think uh, really it's an icon of the city now. I know when I bring people in from out of town and I give them the little Detroit tour and we drive along the riverfront here that it's the first thing they notice is this symbol of power, this very iconic symbol of power. And everybody knows Joe Lewis, and Joe Lewis was, a, was such a hero to Detroit. It's a big job with a big crew. The cables are replaced about every 10 years, and the cleanup and restoration work will keep the fist looking strong in downtown Detroit. Dave Llewellyn, 7 Action News. All right.